Hello and welcome to today's Technical Corner. Joining me is Colin Cater of CAD Spec and we're going to be talking about some exciting new developments from the Autodesk family of products. Welcome Colin, what's new? Okay, well uh, thank you very much for inviting me along here. Um, there are a number of opportunities that have uh, been developed through, uh, through Autodesk recently uh, and the main thing is a rebranding of their products. So starting from September the, the 14th, uh, and probably customers will have already received letters from Autodesk notifying that there'll be some changes. But the rebranding really is based on their flagship software, which is Fusion 360, now being the named uh, front end of all of their make products. So whether it's PowerMill, Power Inspect, or PowerShape, they'll all be listed as uh, or named as Fusion 360 with PowerMill. Fusion 360 with Power Shape or Fusion 360 with Power Inspect. Okay, and what impacts that going to have on existing customers? Well, it's certainly going to increase their capability because it's not just a rebranding of uh, of the packages, but you're getting a lot more functionality. There will be a lot more collaborative uh, additional products within each of the portfolios. So hopefully, it's a really exciting time for customers. And presumably, there's a new pricing structure. For well, yeah, um, if we start with the flagship power mill, for example, um, the power mill will tra traditionally had a power mill standard, a premium and an ultimate. The premium is uh, being discontinued from this new promotion. So there will just be a power mill standard and a power mill ultimate. But as far as the premium customers, what they will get, they will actually get the ultimate package, which is a good 20-25% reduction in price. Okay, so for a lot of people are going to get more for less? They're certainly going to get a lot more for less. It's uh, uh, the Fusion 360 with, with PowerMill, you'll have Fusion 360, you'll have Fusion 360 Teams, you'll have Fusion 360 uh, uh, machining capability extensions and HMS work. So you'll actually get four or five products within this and uh, those traditionally that have, may have used feature cam in the past, may have seen in the last few weeks that uh, Fusion 360 comes with feature cam. So the, what you're seeing here on, this, on, on the screen is the ability in one case that you can use the free six, uh, Fusion 360 front end to create turning tooling that can then be used. So this can then go into your library of your feature cam. So you can then be able to get greater capability from the feature cam, which will also enable you then when you start looking at the uh, power mill and other mm. f functionality software that you will actually get the Fusion 360 CAD, which is an amazing front end engine for, for designers. Absolutely. You see the Fusion products used across the country, across the globe to actually come up with solid models, isn't it? Correct. Yeah. And then in times gone by, often it was export, uh, exported to other software, whereas yeah. now arguably you don't need to do that. That's true. And I think the, uh, the, the big push with having this collective capability and this flexibility is that if you want your CNC machine to be machining metal and you don't want it to be designing jigs and fixtures and tooling, you can be doing that with the Fusion mm -hmm. uh, capability. So you guys, you've been working with Autodesk for quite some time now. As, you know, as a, as, as, a, as a partner, how do you think it's going to be seen in the marketplace? And honestly, do you think how much of an advantage? Well, from CAD specs uh, point of view, what we see is the uh, capability now that we can offer a whole array of training packages because if you've got four or five additional uh, capabilities within your software you, you want to understand what they can all do individually or collectively um, and I think that each customer that starts to look at this now will be able to sort of really expand and develop their own design mm -hmm. uh, man and manufacturing capability. And this starts September 2020? Yeah uh, it starts to those existing uh, subscription users at the moment it will start to migrate as of September the 14th now that will actually roll out over a certain period of time so customers that are uh, renewing some of their software will actually see this this change and, and like I mentioned earlier that customers will have received emails and probably letters from Autodesk explaining some of these changes yeah, and Autodesk, like if you go on their website, they've got, I don't know how many seats of software, how many different softwares, but it's dozens, isn't it? So why do you think they've uh, chosen Fusion as the lead brand, if you like? I think the, the Fusion front end allows you to then start working with a CAD CAM package. And because it's 
it is so, uh, and from what I've seen, it is just so inclusive in all of the things that you can do. Uh, as, a, as an entry system from a CAD package on its own, in its own right, is, is amazing. When you combine it with some of these, uh, some of the manufacturing uh, software as well, it just can give you such a, a wide range of uh, capabilities. Mm. And I know we can't necessarily talk price, it depends what you want essentially, mm. but, but I was blown away. If you just want the basic Fusion uh, 360 software, you know, you, well, you tell them how much is it a day? <laughs> well, it's a pound a day for for the uh, Fusion 360, uh, just on it on its own. Uh, you can download a free 30 day uh, demo license as well, mm -hmm. and then you come to CAD Spec when you want to buy the software because the uh, buying the software is one thing, but you may also want to have some dedicated training on that. And I think that's really what, what we offer. There are training courses online, there are tutorials online. There's lots of stuff to do with Fusion 360 online. Uh, but a dedicated course hopefully gets people off to the right start. Yeah, and just finally, Colin, if people want to learn more about what we've talked about today, or indeed CAD spec, how do they find out more? They just go online and talk to, uh, and just type in CAD spec, www.cadspec.co.uk for more information. Uh, we're quite active on LinkedIn, for example, but uh, we've got a very, um, uh, very good website where you can hopefully get all of the information that you need. There we have it. Thank you, Colin. Thank you. So if you want to find out more about Fusion 360 and all the new add-on uh, products, speak with the guys at CADSpec.